everyone, it's Nona Grace, and I'm from Western New York. Today's video is going to be a tag video. I was tagged by Keto Marnie, and I probably say that two more times, so hi, hi Marnie. <laughs> <laughs> and Lucky Gracie. Who else? Oh, well, um, Keto Diamond mm -hmm. was tagged her. But I also mentioned that twice before. <laughs> and I also mentioned Lucky Gracie a couple times, or now I've done it a couple times. Um, she, when I did the video, of, or the little video of the fall foliage, Jim must have liked it, and I didn't finish my statement in the video that you're going to see. And he went out and tried to get me some more, and then I sent him out again today. So you're going to see... The those of you that like motorcycles will see a ride, and those of you that like to listen to me talk, because <laughs> boy, I talk. <laughs> and even in that video, I got distracted. That darn dog, he was distracting me, and the chickens were distracting me. I had to stop it. I don't know how many times because pretty boy crowed twice today, and then he crowed a third time. He wanted they wanted a snack three times. They got a snack. I gave him mm -hmm. the regular snack twice, and then I gave him a, a short snack because I figured, you got to stop. Then I was going to go out and lock him in because it had stopped raining. Oh, and guess what? There's two chickens out, so I can't lock them in. <laughs> so there, well, I'll have to wait till they all go back in. They were all in because it was raining pretty hard, and I thought, this is going to be too hard to go out and lock them in. So I thought I'd wait till the rain sort slowed down or stopped. And they must have been waiting for the same thing because Brownie, the real dark brown one, and a black one came out, and they were out looking for worms probably. I had Mr. Brown outside today also, and he took a little adventure. And you know those stink bugs, those beetles that the other chickens won't eat? He was eating them. He must think they taste good. He doesn't know they're not supposed to taste good. The other chickens won't have anything to do with them. But he was catching them, eating them. He was playing with a couple of them at first, and then he decided to eat it. And then after that, he was eating several of them. He walked around the house. He went from the garden around the house to the, to the camper. And he was under the camper for a while. And I clapped my hands, and he came to me, and which is good because... You know, I can't, I went into the camper to see what I could see. And when I came out, I didn't know where he was. But I clapped my hands and he came, and it's a good thing he comes. Well, let's go to the video, and I hope you enjoy. Today I'm going to try something a little different. I was tagged, so I'm going to do the tag while you can visually watch if you like or you can audio hear what I'm saying. Some of you like to watch videos and some of you like to just listen, so this way you can do both if you wish. Jim took a little ride for me yesterday and the camera that he used was not the regular GoPro. It was a little camera from Aldi's and the video was really jiggly and it made me actually motion sick. So I thought I can't post that. So I decided I would have him go out and get me another video. So today he went out. He said it's not as pretty a day because the weather is kind of cloudy-ish at times and then sunny so it's kind of a mixed day, but the video is still of the fall weather. So lucky, lucky Gracie, you're very lucky, because he he liked that I took some fit up uh, video of the oh that darn dog is is distracting me. Jake wants out of his little house. I put him in the house because he was barking and he was 
his toes were going everywhere and he was making a lot of noise so I put him in his little carrier and now he's gonna bark he normally doesn't bark but because he can hear me talking in here he's going to bark so uh, what I want to do is I want to do this tag with this video so I'm going to do the tag I was tagged by Keto Marnie and she was tagged by Keto Diamond so that's who we were tagged by I don't know if this is recording now I just did it all and now I found that it's not there so I'm gonna have to stop it and see whether it's there oh my goodness it was there well I was tagged by I just said Keto Marnie and she was tagged by Keto Diamond and the tag is a fall tag and what I'm going to do is answer the questions and you can listen to the answers and you can watch the ride so those of you that like motorcycles can watch the ride in the country and those of you that like to just listen can just listen well the first question on the tag there's nine questions the first question is the fall favorite cool weather oh my I'm messing up this time because I'm now I now I don't know whether it's recording and it makes me very nervous to think that it might be not recording and I'm talking but anyways it's a nine question tag and I was supposed to tag someone but I'm not going to tag anyone it's going to be an open tag so that you can, if you wish to do it you can the questions will be in the more section the first question is favorite cool weather food well, I don't really have a cool weather food, but I do like making crack slaw. And crack slaw is made with, you can make it with hamburg, you can make it with ground chicken, you can make it with ground turkey, you can make it with sausage meat, you can make it with all of those meats put together, which that's how I do it. And you make it with cabbage, cooked cabbage, and there's tomato and there's onions in it. And it is so good and it's done in the crock pot. Favorite cool weather smell? My favorite cool weather smell is, I guess, fresh, crisp air. Not that I like the cold, but when you go outside in the fall, in the morning especially, it is so fresh and crisp that the air smells, actually smells good. Favorite place to view in the fall? Well, you're looking at it. With this ride, you're seeing the favorite place we like to take rides and look at the foliage and look at the lake. That lake that you're passing right now is Chautauqua Lake. I used to ice fish on that when I was younger. Well, back to the tag. Um, let's see, my favorite color? Well, it's coming up. It's orange. I like the color orange. You'll see a lot of orange in this video. I like the bright, vibrant orange, not the dull orange. And there is some yellow and there is some red, very little red. Right now you're passing a cornfield. So, and there's the red. Those are the red leaves. The reds are usually on the, the brush kind of leaves. They're not on really on trees. Well, they are trees, but they're, they're not. It's usually in the woodsy areas. Okay, let's see. My favorite fall memories. I guess would be probably oh wait I forgot something best fall event that was next no that wasn't next movie is next what is my favorite fall movie that puts me in the mood well I guess hocus pocus would be the movie that I would watch best fall event would be when I was a witch at the state park and there was a wagon ride going on and I had to dance around a fire singing my little witchy song and dressed up like a witch and good thing I had a fire because it was a chilly night my favorite fall memory would be well probably corn roasts because at the end of the summer we'd be picking the corn and we'd have the big bonfire and there would be the corn in that so it would be at the end of August beginning of September somewhere in there I guess it's getting close to fall and scary thing about fall would be like when I would be coming home from babysitting 
the the walk from my house to to or from the neighbor's house to my house it was very dark in the country there's no city lights and it was a very short distance but you always think something's going to pop out of the ditch and so you run and your heart's pounding as fast as it can pound and you make yourself get yourself home it scares you i hope i answered all the questions and i hope you enjoyed this little ride well i will see you all tomorrow so take care Bye-bye.